The exhibit is entitled Free Space in Place and it's actually focusing on four projects proposed for Venice by modern masters which were all uh, never realized. But if I asked you once again, it's uh, a development of a 1972 exhibit in the Art Biennale by Carlo Scarpa entitled Quattro Progetti per Venezia and that's why I would like I'm having this filmed in the in his garden within the Biennale, so because he's not represented in the exhibit proper. So the four projects are uh, Frank Lloyd Wright's Mazieri Foundation, the hospital, which would have been in the Canareggio district by Le Corbusier. Um, I'm giving them in uh, chronological order. And uh, next would be Louis Kahn's Palazzo dei Congressi, which was on two sites in the Giardini here, but also at the Arsenale. Uh, where it would span across. And then uh, the, the least well documented is a, is a park that was proposed uh, to be designed by Isamo Noguchi, the great Japanese American sculptor um, in Jezolo, which is on the very east part of the lagoon. And it was actually situated between the ocean and the lagoon. And there are two purposes. One is to sort of remind us that in fact uh, the critical point that Scarpa was making in 1972 at the, at the Biennale that in his mind Venice is a perfect place for modern buildings and Venice is able to receive modern buildings he thought maybe better than other Italian cities because of the water because of the variety of building heights other things and uh, and yet here we are today 40 more than 40 years later with no no substantial new buildings uh, built and certainly none of the quality built by those four architects the profession of architecture, I think, uh, loses something extremely significant if we overlook unbuilt works. With Louis Kahn, who actually had far more unbuilt projects than he had built projects. And his uh, statement was very optimistic. He said, something that's not built, that which is not built, is not really lost. Once its quality is established, its demand for presence is undeniable. It's merely waiting for the right circumstances.